Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and we're going to pick up right where we left off here and keep working our way through the Deshong Tower. Uh, so we uh, finished the, uh, or cleared the first floor, if you didn't catch that in the last episode. And, uh, yeah, we're just going to work our way up to uh, up to the top. Don't think we're going to get all the way up to the top in this episode, but we're going to start working towards it, and we'll see um, if this is going to be a... Actually, you know what I think I'm going to do? Why don't we make a, a way for us to get up through here? Uh, but we won't make it permanent so we can pick blocks up as needed to prevent... Whoa, a little lag going on there. Uh, the zombos down below from getting up here. Um, yeah, if we put... Let's see. If we put that there, that should prevent them from even attempting to jump up there. Yeah, okay, that's good. Uh, all right, yeah, so let's uh, keep working through here now. Let's see, what day is it? It is day 73, so we got lots of time before the next Horde Night, so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, I know this isn't the normal way you come up to Shang. You're supposed to go up through the, uh, you know, through the stairs, but it's not going to really matter, so let's just um, bust this door out. And, uh, yeah, start working our way through here. I know I keep saying that, huh? <laughs> um, there's a possibility... I'm just going to throw this out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Throw this out there. It's a possibility. I haven't seriously considered it, but I'm leaving my options open that we might actually move into this tower at some point in the near future in this playthrough. Maybe. We'll see. I've always wanted to have a base in the Deshong Tower. I've never actually done it, and the main reason why I've never actually done it is because... Um, is because it's, it's just such such a high you know tower it's so high up uh, unless we live lower down but i mean if you're going to live in the tower you might as well live in the penthouse right <laughs> so we'll see um the other thing too that i realized after i had left you guys in the last episode was that i actually need to move that land claim block closer to the center maybe we'll make a new one and put it in the top of that thing where that duffel bag is uh, because it's not actually covering the front part of the building. Um, so we'll have to do that. Okay, anyway, let's go in here. Looks like we've got some bookshelves. How are we? Oh, shit. That scared the hell out of me. I was going to say, how are we supposed to get in there? All right. Come here. I guess we break the glass. <laughs> there, isn't, there isn't an actual door in here. Not, well, maybe that's considered the door. I don't know. Anyway, it does matter. Uh, okay, let's check the beverage thing. Got a couple things of miso. Uh, are, is there charges in there? No, no charges. And bookshelves. Awesome. All right, what do we got? Shotgun Messiah Volume 1. Shotgun. Oh, yeah, we'll take that. 10% more damage, baby, on the shotguns. And a looting book there. Uh, sure, let's unlock this because there is a chance for there to be a schematic in here. And, oh, look at that right straight up. Almost. Okay, let's go to the right just a smidge. Okay, let's go to the left just a smidge. There we go. That was easy. And yeah, we got a book. Okay, cool. We got a book out of the deal. Let's pick up the bong computer. <laughs> bong computer. Any charges in here? No charges in there. Okay. Um, We have another bong computer. We'll pick that up. Put that in the disassembly station and i think that's oh the desk yeah let's check out the desk got a little gunpowder nifty okay let's just work our way around this way here so i mentioned to you guys in the last episode that i have seen uh, glock 9 go through here in alpha 20 but i myself have not been through deshong in alpha 20 i've been through it a million bazillion times prior to alpha 20 well not a million bazillion but you know what i mean um, so it's kind of cool to see, you know, how they changed it. Like everything else in Alpha 20, the older POIs are familiar, but they're also new, uh, which is really cool. Okay, looks like we have a lab assistant, Zika Ruski, there. Um, let's get around so we have a nice clear headshot. And I'm feeling like, you know, crossbow action here, maybe. You dead. Okay. Any crossbows for us? All right, so we got some meds uh in here like a little little pharmacy here in the building that's awesome 
But as usual in these cases, we're not really getting <laughs> getting much to write home to mother about. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay. Sneaking skill has improved to 31. Look at us and our bad selves. My drone runs into stuff and makes that banging noise, and it always freaks me out because it sounds like a zombie's dropping down from the ceiling or something. All right, let's work over here. We have one bookshelf. Quite possible that there's Zeke's behind a counter here. Let's check this bookshelf here. And paper. All right, we'll take some paper. Any coffee in here? There are no charges. Let's open that up. Got a little bit of beer. What about you? And some goldenrod tea. Okay, let's see if there's anyone sleeping behind a counter here. Nope, looks like we're good, and there's no hidden safes or anything like that. Pack and go. So this is like the FedEx store in the building. I like it. I like it. Okay, we've got uh, Spider Zombo, or formerly known as Spider Zombo. Okay, nice. A little ammo pile. I'm loving it. And we got ourselves some 7.62s, which we can use in our shiny M60. Little mechanical parts in the trash there. Okay. The generally useful stuff in the boxes here in this wonderful Undead Legacy mod. Man, I love this mod. Just... For me, it just really enriches the game, I think. Okay, so what we're supposed to do here now is... Oh, we are... Actually, yeah, let's go down there. There's a bag. Oh, we got to get the bag on top of the little awning thing, too. Hey, we got a bandage out of the deal. Can't complain about that too much, eh? All right, let's go back up here. So we're supposed to climb up this way... And do a little bit of parkour action. Uh, I guess we go all the way to here and then jump off this way. Yeah, go through here. But I am going to go back to the stairwell. And, you know, just keep working on the stairwell because when it's all said and done, I want to be able to go all the way up and down the, the stairs. Okay, so this little, you know, um, destroyed area on floor three. Has always been in the building, but things do look different here. Let's get this guy ready. We'll do more sneaky sneaks. Oh, man, that scares me. Incoming enemies, prepare for conflict. Enemies or enemy? Okay, come here, Jiggly. <laughs> Looks like that's. That's all we got to worry about in this corner here. All right. Anything to loot down here? Does not look like it. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's go through here. Probably more Zeke's behind that counter, maybe. Quit bumping into walls. You were quiet. All right. We got a greenie. A dead one. That's the best way to have greenies is dead. Yeah, we got rad remover. We got rad remover. Uh, uh, at least on these two weapons. Okay. Eventually, I'd like to have rad remover on damn near everything because we're going to run into more and more greenies as our, our stages go up. There's a charge in there. Where does that door go? I don't know. All right. Let's check this. We already have um, a plastic bottle ready to go for the coffee. That's a good thing. I'm going to unlock this door because I'm curious to see where it actually goes. It's probably just going to lead right out into the hallway where the hole is in the floor, I think. 
But let's open it up anyway. If nothing else, we'll get a couple more points for lock picking. There we go. Yep. One more little bump down. Oh, really? Come on, man. What the heck? Yeah, that's what I figured. Okay. It wasn't a waste of time because we got some points for that. We do have a trash here with some copper in it. Um, maybe some Zikaroos in the bathroom here. Let's go over here first, though. Okay, looks like we have a storeroom back here. Anybody going to jump on our head? Nope, I think we're good. Okay, let's check the stuff. Actually, I'm going to stay crouched because if there are Zeeks nearby, we keep getting points for that. Chicken soup, okay. Nice big pile of food there with some mineral water. Are we thirsty? Yeah, we are kind of thirsty. And let, let's just eat the pears too because we're kind of hungry. And pears aren't used in any recipes. Nice. Uh, in fact, we're going to eat that right now. That should get our food pretty much topped off, I think. All right, is there anything in this corner? No siree, Bob. Okay, let's keep moving. We'll check the restroom here. Do I see feet in there, or is that just the... No, that's just the toilet. The base of the toilet. Wow. Quite a bit of stuff in that little trash can there. Okay, nobody in there. That is a disassemble vending machine. Let's take it apart. Okay, I see a businessman, Zombadoodle. Have to break the glass first. And he did. No charges in there. Looting skill has improved to 60. That's a beautiful thing. Oh, he's feral too. Is this locked? Nope. And another book. Beautiful. We need books. You got a bolt for us? Uh-uh. Okay, no bolts. Now, didn't, uh, isn't this the floor that used to collapse, or am I thinking of the, and it doesn't necessarily mean it still does anymore. No, nope, I think that floor's fine. It might, I think that's actually higher up on the construction floor. All right, let's break into here and open up the stairwell. Yeah, I, I guess I could <laughs> kind of unlock that too. All right, I'm not actually going to put anything down right now. Uh, we'll just put blocks down later when we need to, to use it. Oh, that's neat. There's like a little a little balcony out here. Very cool. With some yuccas, too. I'm going to leave those there for now. Me likey. Very nice. I mean, generally speaking, I, I like the, the POI changes in Alpha 20. You know, the POI changes to the older ones. I don't, I can't really think of a situation where I haven't liked the new changes. So, oh, here, yeah, let's unlock this. Let's just keep working on our lock picking skill. I mean, at some point, we're going to max this out anyway. We're doing really good on it. We can already open up a lot of stuff without even needing the candy, so that's good. I do want, I do want to make some lock picks, though, because they're just more durable than the bobby pins. Of course, on the other hand, the bobby pins are a lot cheaper. Oh, okay, so that opens up into here. All right, we're supposed to, the game wants us to go around. Okay, we will, I just, we can do that. We can do that. All right, let's grab this. We're going to run into some more business Zikaroos. 
coming through here, I'm sure. I guess if we're picking shit up, we might, we might as well pick these up. Uh, do they stack, though? I don't know. Let's do a second one and see if they actually stack. Office chairs. Here. Yeah, they do stack. Okay. Filing cabinet with some paper. Okay, this is the part where we go out onto the balcony and have some fun with the Zeeks. Some adhesive. All right, now, sometimes there's vultures down there. Uh, if there are any, I can't see them from here. That jump was... All right, so yeah, what's going to happen is we're going to jump over to here, and I think that's going to aggro a bunch of Zika roots. So let's just make sure um, little friend is loaded and shotgun is loaded. Nice. Okay. I didn't wake anybody up. Okay. Stuff doesn't suck. So they must have changed this because there's usually there was usually a couple of dudes up here that would spawn in when you jumped over onto this ledge. And maybe they still do, but the RNG just didn't put them in this time. I don't know. I fully expect us to run into dudes in here, though. Is there actual glass in there? Uh-uh. Okay. Any sniping opportunities? No, because they're all hiding around the corner. Oh, that's a projector. I'm, I was going to say, what the heck is that blue thingy? All right. I see lots of Zeeks. Let's get over here. Roberta, be quiet. Don't make any noise. Now, what's the possibility of being able to pick these guys off one by one without waking all of them up? We're going to find out here, aren't we? We'll start with you. Okay, that worked out pretty good. Now let's hit this guy over here. Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. All right, we can't get to his head. There's also a dude on the table. Can't really get to his head either because the projector's in the way. Let's see if we have a better angle on this side for the table guy. And there's something down there, too. Nope. All right. Well, let's get all the way back in the corner here and... Look at the shadow on the wall. That is so cool. All right. Over here, bruh. He doesn't know where we are. Okay. That's fine with me. Nifty. All right. Let's get this guy. Master, we are not alone. And we have one more dude. I would like to get my bolts back, too. That's just another business guy. Okay. Uh, all right. Nifty. Yeah, he's awake. All right, we'll just thump him with L sledgehammer. Oh, there's... Oh, wow. Uh, uh, how many are there? A lot. Okay. Whoops. That's not what I had in mind. Okay. <laughs> Crap. 
All right, let's let him drop down and then come to us. Yeah, one at a time, please. That's exactly what I want you to do. Oh, we got a greenie. Right in the ass. And you don't need that head either. All right, come here, Arlene. Oh, lag. Got a glancing blow there. Okay, I think that's... <laughs> I think that's it. Hey, while we're down here, let's go ahead and offload a few things, because we are heavy. So we'll sort by weight. Uh, I don't even want the... Yeah, we'll, take, we'll keep the clay. All right, uh, I shouldn't even have that stuff with me. Let's put all the rest of this in here. We don't need 10 mil rounds. Okay. Uh, so we filled the bike up completely. And... Don't really care about that, actually, either. These we will turn into a couple more bandages. And we are now a little bit lighter on our feet. Okay, let's head on back up to the third floor. Oh, we need to get the, the thingy off of here. Um, I guess we could just nerd pull up there. Oh, wow, look at that. That's cool. I have I have no skill in submachine guns, but still, very nice find. Okay. Cool. Okay, we're just going to head up the stairwell. <coughs> Gesundheit. Excuse me. So freaking laggy in this building, man. Well, not in the building per se, in the whole wasteland. Okay, I think this is where we left off. We came through here, we went through the business area. I tried to jump while I was crouched. That's not me, man. That's the lag that's doing that. I swear. <laughs> All right, I know there's a bunch of chairs and shit in here I could pick up, but let's not worry about that basic stuff for now. We already got that trash can. Okay, so that brings us out into here. We are now back into new territory. Anybody in here? What the hell? <laughs> That's terrible. Absolutely terrible. There's never anything in stalls. Oh, okay. It looks like we need, we need to go that way. All right. Before we do that, though, let's get into this room. This is where all the Zeke's already ran out of, so nothing in there. I just like to break down the doors. It's fun. It's fun to break stuff. That's part of why this game is so fun, because we can break stuff. Okay, I guess that's it for this floor. Now get out of the way. And we move up to the new area. I bet you there's something over here. Nice. We'll take that dead guy there. Server room. Okay. Yeah, I'm not going to I'm not going to keep picking up computers and stuff. I mean, we can always come back later and get all that stuff if we feel the need. All right. Here we are on the 4th floor. This is another 
a business floor, office floor. Just one guy or two? Seems to be just one. I don't want to go rushing in because there's probably more sleepies around. Incoming so. enemies, prepare for conflict. Enemies? Don't say enemies, say enemy. There's a difference. And it could be mean the matter, you know, be a matter of life and death. Mean the difference between life and death. That's what my mouth That's what my brain told my mouth to say, but my mouth, you know, sometimes it does what it wants to. Yeah, come around. There you go. Oh, glancing blow. Off with your head. Okay. Nothing behind there. Yeah, chairs, computers. We can, we're not going to mess with that stuff right now. I just want to move through the building. So we came around that way. All right. We got like a little break room area up here. I thought that was maybe going to happen. Isn't there two? Yeah, I was going to say, I thought there was another one. Here he is. <laughs> that was just him, right? Okay. Nice! Man, we're getting meat stew. Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's just a cheap-ass pocket knife. Okay. There is one charge in there. Okay, we'll check all this stuff here. Doesn't appear to be anything else over here to loot. Let's go ahead and take this apart. Okay, anything in here? No, just a conference room. <clears throat> Master, oh. we are not alone. How did we not wake that guy up that was in the corner? Okay. Go around, you dummy. You guys are so stupid. You act like your brains are rotted out. Are we good? Okay. No safe there. Oh, nice. Um, I don't really care about that. It's it's really only useful in the very early game, and yeah. So let's just scrap it. We'll get the research data. Nothing in the corner office, man. Okay. Elevator shafts and they're sealed off on this floor. This does look really neat in here. I love the changes. I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh man, that's a lot of Zeeks. Let's run the other way or we're gonna keep waking up more new zombos. Got a greenie. You make the journey just pretty, but I am affected. All right. That was fun. <laughs> we get them all? I think so. Oh, laggy. Laggy, laggy, laggy. All right. What is this? This is a. 
storeroom closet place. I hear a bunch of zombadoodles, but I think they're zombies off the street down below. Anything up there? Uh-uh. What about up there? Nope, doesn't look like it. All right, mineral water, baby. We'll take it. Nothing there. Why does that three, five thing still... Uh, that was weird. Okay, nobody in the restroom. None of those desks are lootable. What about this one? Yeah, that one is. Ball cap. Some scrap rubber. Master, we are not alone. That guy's dead, right? I think so, yeah. And stay down. Okay, we just came in through here. Man, do none of the vending machines in this building work? Nothing lootable in here, no wall safes. And same situation in here. Okay. So that takes care of floor four. All right, you guys. Well, we are out of time in this episode. Uh, so I'm basically going to stop this recording and start the next episode and we're going to pick up right where we left off and go right up those stairs and keep on going. I, I, I don't see any reason as long as we have enough food and medical and ammo and stuff like that. Let's just keep going, man. I'd like to get to the top of this, this building and then, you know, assess what it looks like up there. I can't remember exactly what it looks like in Alpha 20. Um, and consider the possibility of living in this building. I would really like to do that. Uh, so with that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share out the video, and we'll catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.